Hey everybody, Skyrolink here. Welcome back to our episode of Shadow Hearts from the New World. In the last episode, we visited Chicago and met Mao, or Mao, Matt, uh, Frank's master. And we also met some other wacky characters, well not wacky, but we also met some other folks, such as Edna Capone and Ricardo. And Mao had told us that she does in fact know something about Gilbert. More specifically, where his old lab is. But before she gives us that information, she wants us to help, help her break Al Capone out of Alcatraz prison. And this time, we're going to be doing just that. But first things first, I'm going to head back to New York. Because if you remember, we did get a ring fragment. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to return that to the ring spirit right here, right now. Because, you know, that's just the right thing to do. I got stuck on the child. So we're going to go right here. Hey, Ring Spirit. Thanks, bud. Try not to yell Ring Spirit so loudly. Okay, um, is there something else I can tell I can call you? Hey, now that I think about it, I don't know your name either. Didn't we introduce ourselves? Not now that you mention it. Maybe not. Ha 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 ha! We are so weird, aren't we? My name is Aya. What's yours? That's an unexpectedly normal name. I'm Johnny. Johnny Garland. Johnny, huh? Alright then, little Johnny. Here's your reward for this time. An attack boost. Make sure you call me by my name from now on, okay? Bye-bye! Little Johnny. She's getting a little too familiar. Well, that's an attack boost. Um, Let's see. Oh, well, let's give it to Shania. So she can hit. Now, she does have a hit area expand, so I think I'll expand the first area. There we go. Alright, so now what I want to do... Because I want to head over to the Garland office because I believe at this point, if we go back and talk to Lenny... Yes. Master Johnny, we've got trouble. This is serious. What's the fuss? Why are you yelling? This morning, this letter came, in to, came to the office. Let me see. Greetings, Johnny Garland. My name is Tinkerbell. I'm the mysterious thief who's been terrorizing New York lately. Tinkerbell? I don't think I've heard of him before. But more importantly, please read the rest of the letter. Recently, I heard you had opened a detective agency, so I took the liberty of writing you this letter. For a diehard Sherlock fan like myself, having a little run like you around playing detective is irritating. So I've sent you this code and chess in order to test your abilities. If this simple code is too much for you, you need to quit the foolishness and run home to mommy, okay, Pee-wee detective? What? What is this? This really pisses me off. Lenny, where's that code? Here it is. Yikes. Inside each of the squares, there is a number 1 through 9, which each number only used once. The numbers to the right and below are the sums of the numbers lining up with them horizontally and vertically. If you can figure out the numbers that go in A and B, you should be able to open the chest. Hmm, so this means I have to arrange the numbers 1 through 9 so that they match the totals, right? Yes, I believe so. This chest has a two-number input lock on it, so if you were to enter the numbers that go in A and B... Alright, stand back and watch. I'll have this figured out in a second. So we're supposed to... I do know the answer to this code because, well, I did the math myself. I'm a math whiz myself, so I do know the answer. But I mean, you can look it up yourself, but that's no fun. At least try to solve the puzzle yourself, and if you really can't do it, then look it up. Or watch the walkthrough. Anyway, yeah, show me the code. So as he says... I can give an example of how this works. So we go to the leftmost part, and we see the numbers 3 at the bottom and 1 on the left, on the, on the right. We can assume that, by deduction, the bottom left number is 1. And then we can assume that the 1 above it is 2. And they already give us 7. So essentially you have to play, uh, plug in the numbers as you try to figure out what sums, like, add up to the certain number. So it's a lot of trial and error. So with that being said, by deduction, because I know the numbers, I can tell you that the one below seven is a three. So by deduct by that deduction, um, two plus three equals five, and then ten minus five equals five. So we know that for a fact that a is five. Now b is tricky. I was able to figure out five on my first playthrough, no problem. But b was kind of tricky. So we know that the 1 under 7 is 3, so that equals 10. 
Actually, no, this is actually- No, I, I, I think I got B first, but then A I couldn't really figure out. A had trial and error that. But, it's three plus- If you can figure out one of them, you can figure out the other. So it really isn't that hard, but like, so if, for example, we know that the 1 under 7 is 3, so 3 plus 7 equals 10. So 10, so 19 minus 10 equals 9. Yeah, yeah, give me the tutorial. So if we go to this chest, so I need to enter the numbers for A and B here, huh? The number for A is 5, and the number for B is 9. There! Alright, it opened. There was a vacuum cleaner inside the, in the chest. Vacuum acquired. What is this? There's a letter attached to it. Let's see. Congratulations, Pee Wee Detective. You managed to crack the code. The item inside is a little reward. It might be a little hard for a scrawny little guy like you to handle, though. He always makes fun of me. Lenny, find out all you can about this Tinkerbell. Oh, so you mean to say... I'm gonna catch him myself. I'll make him regret calling me a Pee Wee Detective. Understood. I'll contact you as soon as I find anything. I'm counting on you. That seems like it went well enough. I don't really like fooling the master, though. But... So welcome to Johnny's side quest. This is just like uh, Natan had a gun fu quest, or his Uma hunt quest. Johnny has the Tinkerbell quest. What we just got the vacuum is a new ability, kind of like his snap ability. We'll be sure to demonstrate that soon enough. That became- you can do this at any time, but that just became available right now. So we'll do it when we can. So I want to take care of that first and foremost. Because now, it's time for Alcatraz Prison. Oh, it stinks. Was this the only entrance? Don't be such a baby. We are sneaking into the world's most secure prison. I think just the fact that there's no risk to our lives is pretty good. Uh, I get it, so let's move. Otherwise, I'm gonna barf. Welcome to Alcatraz. My- one of my top three favorite dungeons in this game. So I'm gonna save our game here. And honestly, I love the theme of Alcatraz. It's one of my favorites. It's really incredible, man. Is it locked? Well, I guess that's to be expected. So what are we gonna do? Can you open it? This kind of old lock isn't anything to get worked up about. Move aside. Right, I can open this lock. Oh, just like Master, you've already mastered the art of unlocking doors. M my eyes are playing tricks on me. Did you just have a pouch on your belly? You just pulled a key. F you just pulled the key from there. Don't say such silly things. I'm not a kangaroo. If you're gonna be dumb, I'll just leave you here. I like Mao. Mao's pretty cool. Alright, so let us move onward. <coughs> oh, whoa. Uh, ooh, 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 there's a little secret. Seal 1. That is a uh, status on the ring. I'll save that for later. Hey, you there! What are you doing over there? Uh-oh, they found us. Hey, wait! Freeze! I'll show you what fighting is all about. Just like the gangsters in Chicago, make sure to snap a picture of these prison guards, because you're not going to be fighting these guys very often. These guys aren't too tough. They're kind of little baby fodder. I'll show off the vacuum after I take a picture, though. These guys are perfect Look to show here. this off. Smile and say cheese. 
Oh, he's crushed over. He looks like he's having a heart attack. He's like, ah! Uh, judging by, uh... Whoops. Uh, judging by, uh, the way these guys are, uh... These guys are very weak. 37 health. Frank can easily kill these guys on his own. I say that as he misses. Good job, Frank. These guys' main gimmick is that they, uh... They can lower your stats, like special attacks. That's really about it. They're nothing too dangerous to get worked up about. So Frank's gun food could actually work wonders here. Anyway, vacuum. 44 MP, which is literally half of Johnny's thing, but it could suck up an enemy's stock gauge, which could be pretty helpful. Switch on. Whoa, Johnny quit sucking that man. Anyway, so judging by the way you uh, hit the wing, the wing, no, hit the ring, uh, will judge uh, how much uh, stock you actually take out. So I took out about 70%. Um, I'm gonna keep it real, I'm not gonna use vacuum very often. It's not a bad ability, but definitely one of its Johnny's less exciting ones. Yeah, and a ton shooting everybody to death. That's how we like it. Oh well, yeah, Shania can hit four times now. This was a mismatch. Yeah, free talisman of luck. Anyway, level up for Johnny and Frank. Uh, Johnny, you can use a heal. I go over here. Talisman of luck. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, it's very important you check these cells. They say once you live somewhere, it grows on you. It's so true. You have to learn to compromise. Wiser words have never been said. Thought I heard something over here. Huh, what? Never seen them before. An intruder? Whoa! There's more! Alright, good. Double check my snap. Make sure there's no any extra prison guards. Okay, that's good. Oh, let's go for a, uh... These guys are bundled up. Let's go for guards 1 and 2. Burn them alive, why don't you, Johnny? Man, Johnny's a menace. Um, rapid shot do good damage. Uh, it's two of them. Eh. Do you have anything? You have evil eye. I'll go for the evil eye button to make Natan. Absolutely demolished them. Didn't even get a chance. You aren't ready to face me. Dang! Yes, give me this. Give me three extra souls. Level up for Natan. Phew, maybe we should be more careful. We should be alright now. From what I've heard, Capone's jail cell is just beyond here. Alright, we gotta talk to that guy. And there's this guy over here. Fade it. Why that look like Joe Biden though? Fight me with all you've got. I did not know that uh, you guys actually came this far. This is surprising. Oh, I can only hit three. Uh, let's see. Can an evil eye do some damage? I only hit three at a time. That stinks. Oh well, it is what it is. Alright, uh, I think regular attacks from everyone should do it. They really should do it. I want to see if Johnny Boy can, uh, can take care of him himself. Do it, Johnny. You did it, Johnny. 
so proud of you, buddy. Yeah, give me that souls. We actually have a pretty decent amount of souls, actually. Alright. Uh, there's a chest over here. Give me that. A seal of force. Chow time, Mr. Capone. Just put it down over there, okay? And leave when you're done. I can't eat in peace with other people watching me. Hey, man. What are you doing? Big underworld boss, Al Capone. Here's how they'll tell it. You tried to kill the guard and escape, but failed and got shot dead. Get it? So that's what they planned. Capone! Hmm, yes. It looks like we're right on time. Mal, thanks a lot, buddy. I owe you one. Wow, we. What was that kick technique? <laughs> the master is an expert. It's called Drunken Kung Fu or Drunken Fist. Drunken Fist? By a cat? Pretty impressive, Master Meow. Master Meow, you say? That's a good one, Master Boy. Capone! What was all that ruckus? Huh? Huh? Who are these people? They're all my guests. By the way, could you please arrest this guy? The bum tried to shoot me dead, okay? My god. I think they're on to us. Something's really weird. Let's go. Wait, come back here. Capone, all of you. Sorry, I gotta leave. You know, I could really use a drink. Later. Uh. Damn! Okay, we've got to protect Capone now. I can't trust the two of you boys. I guess I'll lend a hand. Oh, nothing's as reassuring as hearing that Master Meow's going to fight with us. I don't remember saying that you can call me Master Meow. I won't let you call me that again. Now use Battle Team from the command menu. Battle Team. Using Battle Team, you can decide the Battle Team and set up the team members. Do you want to see a detailed explanation of Battle Team? Yeah, sure. In the Battle Team screen, you can decide which team will join in battle and organize members of each team. Let's put together a Team A. In this way, you can select the team you want to, to organize and the characters you want to add. If you want to change a team's, members, te a team's members, select the team you want to reorganize and the members you want to replace. This is how you can change team members. Set a team up for battle, select it with the cursor and press the start button. Now Team C is selected. If you go into battle, Team C will fight. The battle team may be changed by pressing the L1 button or the L2 button while moving the field. This concludes the battle team tutorial. So now we have a new party member. So now we're gonna 
we're gonna have a battle team. So now we're gonna have it set like this. Uh, Natan, you're gonna get the shaft. So we're actually going to transfer, uh, um, we're gonna see what Mao has. Uh, you have a wool coat. Uh, take that. Mao, you can take the leather coat off of him. And you come with a studded cap, studded belt, and a body bracelet. I think I'll take the coral lariat off, uh, the Tan. I'll put a shell bracelet on him. And you can take a coral lariat. And you're already pretty well equipped, I will say. You're pretty much... He's pretty much stacked, actually. So Mal's pretty good right now. And he uses Drunken Kung Fu as his, uh... As his attack. That's his, uh... That's his gimmick. There we go. And now you know. Actually, no, I want to head back in here. Because... We can actually talk to, uh... Old Ness. From Earthbound. That's enough. If you're gonna escape, do it already. Don't blame me for what happens. Is there anything in Capone's room? I don't know. You expect something. Aw, oh, little Nessie Poo's gonna pout. Uh, Seal of Force. I'm actually going to put that on... Wow, Frank's actually not got good power. I'll put that to Frank. And, uh, I'll use the tent on everybody. And I'll save our game. Right here. Nice, nice, nice. So now we got this going. Let's move forward. Uh-oh. We got monsters! The Bayarki. Hey, this is a good opportunity to see Mao in action, though. Probably mess with Mal's ring, actually. Add an effect to it. Good damage. Anyway, Mal! What you got? Uh, Surge, Special Attack Power, uh, Mirage, Aqua Edge, Hail Dust, Red Nova, and Gale Mod Rod. We haven't checked your, uh... We haven't checked your, uh... Stellar Chart. Dang, I stumped. Mal is more of a hard hitter physical attacker. Not as hard as Frank, but that's kind of her gimmick. So she's, you know, she's pretty good. I wouldn't say the best character in the game by a long shot, but she, she has her uses. We'll be using her for a bit. Do that. And that takes care of that. Soul Benediction. What were those beasts doing in a place like this? Someone summoned it here. It's gotta be the reason for all this commotion, too. Yeah, this game is surprisingly dark if you really think about it. <laughs> Alright, so on to the main attraction. Right now I'm in the middle of crafting a secret plan. If you want to talk, come back later. Alright. But yeah, I really like Alcatraz. It's one of my favorite dungeons in the game. Uh, let's go up here. Let's talk to you, buddy. It's not that I botched anything up. I just came to miraculously break out of the tightest prison in the world. 
I've been in five years already, though. See, even in these dire situations, these men can be cheerful. Gotta respect that. Gotta respect that. Uh, anything? Oh, yes. A soul benediction. What do these do again? Uh, heal all status ailments. Okay, those are pretty good. That's pretty good. Alright, what else we got? Uh, we got the, the Yarki, the Chon Chon, and the Womp. By the way, the Chon Chon is one of the best names ever. I am a Chon Chon. Chon Chons are very weak enemies. They don't put up much of a fight, like, at all. Like, even Mao can kill them. Bam, wha bam, wha bam. And this should finish him off. Just fine. Phantom Ring, ooh. Womp, womp, womp. Womps are probably the most dangerous enemy here. Random Ring, I believe it does some wacky effects. Bam, bam. Alright, gonna go for some of this. Some of that. I should take care of that. Zep, no problem. I hit you with the one side. I get an extra soul for my troubles. Ain't that lovely. And hey, Shania grows to level 10. That's lovely. Alright. So Mao's stellar chart. She has the Capricorn, which is pretty meaty, if I gotta say. Got some good stuff. Um, she already got the Mirage. Do I have anything extra I could put on? Nothing but, like, edges, but that's about it. Uh, just something to keep in mind. Nothing crazy out here, though. Anyway, I guess what I like about Alcatraz is that it's kind of... A very gloomy dungeon with like the music and all that stuff. Oh my god, it's a place full of Chon Chons. This will be killing the Chon Chons first. You did it, Johnny. You got him. And why you gotta hate on Johnny like that? He works so hard. Put food on this table. And you have the gall to do a bright rage on him? Like, how mean could you get? Voice crack. Go for the Red Nova. Nice. I will say, of all the Shadow Hearts games, this is definitely the uh, hardest one. I don't know if I mentioned that before. But yeah, this is genuinely. Uh, generally considered to be the hardest Shadow Hearts. And I will say, in the game we've been seeing it gradually start getting up in difficulty, like nothing too hard, but like, it definitely ain't getting easier. You see these enemies, they ain't, they ain't doing like peas worth of damage. They're starting to put up a fight. You know what, that's nice. I like a good challenge. Don't mess with me. Just because I'm a cat. Don't mess with me just because I'm a cat, you little bitch. That's Mal for ya. Alright. Uh, a little bit beat up here, but that's okay. These things happen. But yeah, Alcatraz, in my opinion, is a depressing location. The worst thing since I came here? The forced labor? Food? Guards? Nope. Worst things here in the outside. Thanks, Joe Biden. I'll go over here and get a free lottery ticket. I love the lottery! Anything 
we've got over anything over here. A Bodhi bracelet. That's nice. It's always nice to see a Bodhi bracelet. Oh, I want to talk to the guy. I'm not against using violence. I'm not against using violence. But I will use violence anyway. Because that's just how I roll. Because I'm cool. Johnny, you can go ahead and kill this Chon Chon over here. That's such a great name. Chon Chon. Aww. Look at that little Chon Chon. Chon Chon acting a fool right here. Look at your widow, Chon Chon. Oh, Venom Ring. Not on mouth. Stop hurting Master Meow like that. At least we got that physical defense down. That takes care of that. Did you let your guard down because I'm a girl? What are you, sexist? Got Phoenix Tail though. Honestly, the experience here is pretty good. I got to say. Um, I wanna check out Mal's ring, because I wanna put a uh, effect on there. Let's see. Low odds seal effect. Seal, I think it's like uh, you can't use magic or anything like that, which I think I'd rather put evasion down. Uh, do I have anything I can do? Nope. Nope, 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 nope. I think I'll use a Thera Leaf. Oh, we actually have Thera Seeds, which record, uh, which, uh, we actually have some seeds. 100 MP, 150 HP. Decent stuff. My makeup's not going on well today. Huh? Why do I have makeup in prison? See? Because I'm a supplier. What a whack job. He's a whack job. He's a nutcase. They're all nutcases here. They've been here for years. Hey, what's with this door? What's wrong with it? Let's find another way. Yeah, I question it too sometimes, Johnny. I question it too. Well, I guess we'll have to give up and go home. Hey, having a rough time, are ya? Mind your own business. We're in a hurry. Don't brush me off like that, man. Especially since I've got some interesting information for you. Information? Oh, that door over there? It's got a metal detector. It won't let people carrying dangerous items pass. You're the intruders, right? Carrying lots of vicious items, no? Don't scowl like that. It's just a machine, after all. It's easy to fool. If you wrap knives and other nasty toys in an insulating sheet, you should you should be able to get through. An insulating sheet? Where am I supposed to get that? Get something like that? Just a second. I have something here. I may not look it, but I'm a 15-year veteran of this jail. So what are your terms? You want help breaking free? Now you're talking. Something like that. But right now is no good. I gotta get the timing right. Here's the deal. I can bust out of here on my own. So can y'all just bring me a spoon from the cafeteria? A spoon? Just a spoon? You shouldn't disrespect a spoon. When you're talking jailbreaks, the spoon is notorious. If you bring me one, I'll trade you for an insulating sheet. So now we got a mission. Get this man some silverware. I'm not afraid of you. I'm not afraid of you. We got two wants. Damn. Uh, Shania, you can uh, mm, you can attack the wants. Some of that damage. Mal, you can attack the Bayarki. 
that wasn't that good. It's good damage though. Uh, we could kill that Womp. I could have gone either or, but I'm more worried about the Womp than anything. Stop burning, mashing me out like that. And Frank is paralyzed. Great! Just great. At least Johnny... Johnny took care of this man. Special defense. Do I have any items to cure this paralysis? Uh, Daphne Freaks are actually pretty good, though. Uh, Soul Benediction. You see, we don't believe in in uh, getting rid of having items for one specific status. We have stuff for all statuses, which is pretty useful. Now, can, now Frank can deal some damage to this wall. I'll have to kill it. Actually, the poison would kill it. Man, you hate Mao. One damage! Yay! Mess with New Yorkers. That was so fast, that kind of spooked me. Just took a little tick and bam, dead. Anyway, level up for Johnny and Mao. Oh, that was good. Oh, Alcatraz is stealing the laughs. Oh, oh good stuff. Alright, so if you're wondering where the cafeteria is, it's down here, which is why I didn't go down here. So let's look around. I'm looking for a spoon. No spoon here. Well, there is a secret chest here, and it has spikes. What are spikes, you may ask? Good question. Spikes. Uh, prevent stock attacks, but SP lowered for on attack. Messes with your sanity, not really worth it. Anyway, look, shiny object. Shiny is good. We got the jailbreak spoon. Chest right here, I'm gonna get special attack down one. It's pretty good. Uh, physical defense down, special defense down, poison one, and evasion down. Uh, I'll give a special attack down to Mal. I think I want to keep the poison on Frank for just a little bit longer. Uh, because, I don't know, I think it's funny that we've been killing enemies in like one, with one damage. Like a little tick and they're dead. The yeah, ice were surrounded. I find that funny, okay? Oh, you missed with your random ring. That red gnome was gonna hurt. Dang, these guys suck. They can't even hit a status effect on me. You guys stink. They smell like sausages. Um, I'll go ahead and take care of this guy. You do it, can't you? You can! Good boy. Do some of that. And Frank. Bam bam. And ooh, we actually get a chance to... We can probably kill this guy right now. Physical defense reduced. Now go ahead and do some of this. And this should finish it off. Nice. Not even worth mentioning. Hm. Good job, Frank. You are now level 10. I'm going to heal Johnny and Mao. Alright, so let's go back to the to the swindler man. Smith the swindler. Oh, that's it! Okay, here's what I promised you. The insulation sheet. 
I'm going to stay quiet here for a little while longer. If you need any more help, swing by again. I know what's what, being a 15-year veteran of this jail and all. Alright, let's see. Is there anything on the walls? Uh... No. Okay. Oh, before I can even... Get it. Got some enemies. Well, that's okay. I don't mind the grind. Even though you don't really even need to grind in this game. Because it's challenging, but totally doable. Oh, come on, Mao. Like, come on, man. You could do better than that. I should say, well, man. Take care of you. Not the evil eye. Yikes, Johnny Boo. Oh, I did not mean to attack you. Man, everyone's sucking today. What's going on? Alright, let's try this again, Mal. Let's try this again. Good. Good. Get it, I'm so proud of you. That's enough to make a grown man cry. But not this man. Get back in there, Tear. Gotta love those Earl Scout cookies. Hey, you. Be sure to brush your teeth. Hey, do be sure to brush your teeth. Give me that. Give me that good stuff. Now it takes that insulation sheet. We can now move forward. Which is nice. I love moving forward in my video games. Uh, right here, actually, there's a Thera Relief. I knew there was something behind some of these stairs. And hey, guys, you got locked up. Haha, <laughs> just as I was selling some prohibited stuff, I got arrested. But you don't need to worry about me. I bribed the guards so I can come and go as they please. Lots of hot bods here, and the prison plays are so exciting. Let me buy something for now. Uh, let's see what you got. Uh, nothing nuts. Just another chance to buy some uh, stuff for the buddies. Uh, let's see. We're all good on this stuff. I do need to buy a... Uh, let's see, who needs a belt? Frank needs one. And three of us need a cap, so anything else? Uh I'll buy a tent, sure. And we have talismans of lux for days, we're fine. I'll buy an extra soul benediction. And I'll buy some thorough leaves too. So let's go for that 20% discount. Man, I was never this good whenever I first played this game. Nice, 28 points. We have a little bit of codes before we get 30% off. So let's go ahead and get this uh, stud cap on me. Uh, stud cap on Shania. Get all this stuff on Frank. And we are pretty good. What about you, Bugen? Jeez, Jerry's in the jam getting caught by the police like that. Well, he was taken in with, with the motorcycle, so won't interfere with business. What do you want to do, boy? I don't want to support a prisoner. Oh, hello, sir. Is it awfully loud this evening? When the guards aren't doing their job, it's tough on us, too. Aw, oh, poor dude. I feel bad. Oh, hey, chest! Hail dust sell stellar. Seller. Give me up the stairs, damn it. Alright, anything going on over here? Random encounter, that's what. Get 
just kill that Tauntaun real quick. Alright. This will kill you. Yes, it did. Now, Frankie Poo, go ahead and do some damage. Get, get down with your bad side, Frank. Don't for the evil eye. Oh, evil! That I thought. Well, we. Alright. Anything? Nothing at all. Um. I'll heal Frank. So that's that. Go over here. Anyone over here? Yeah. It's goodbye to this prison pretty soon. Uh, keep that secret from the guards. The reason I'm kind of going around talking to everyone is because it is important that you do that and know where everyone is. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. For something in the future. Don't worry about it. Don't sweat it. I feel like there's like... There is an item. There's a random encounter, that's what. Let's do I swear to god, this episode might go as long as a freaking Persona episode. <laughs> They're not all like this. We can confirm, it's just we had a long string of them. That's just how things go. It's an RPG after all, you gotta expect things like that. Let's go ahead and take care of you. Yikes. That said, the designs of these monsters are pretty cool. Definitely one of my favorite parts of this uh, game. Seeing all the wacky, grotesque enemy designs. It's scary stuff, I gotta say. Very scary stuff. Alright, Shania. Yeah, main business, girl. Oh, there's that random ring. Go with his stuff. Gave me a slow ring effect. Oh, great. Now you're giving me now the random ring. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Well, perhaps Johnny can finish him. Finish the feast off. He did! Don't mess with New Yorkers. We're pretty nasty. Come from Brooklyn. And I also come from a well known university in Boston. Alright, so let's go and check this out. What are you up to? Hey, what's that voice? Something happened, right? Please don't leave me here all alone. Uh, another chest over here. Hit area expand. Who can use this? Um, I'm thinking Frank. So let's see. Anything in the corner? Nope. What about up the stairs? Ooh. Stairs are scary. One hit. That ain't good. Guess I'll keep attacking the Womp. Taking a wild Womp down the road. Not the double attack. Got 
get that random ring effect. I feel like sometimes with the random ring, it's like sometimes it doesn't even do anything. It's kind of funny. Alright, wha bam, wha bam, wha bam. That was a complete waste of time. That was a complete waste of time. You're right, Shania. Where would we be without you? Ooh, but you're close to level 11. That's nice. Johnny, use a cure on yourself. What's popping down here? Nothing! Uh, you, sir. I don't want to talk to anyone now. Please leave me alone. You, sir. When I was a kid, my gramps told me this prison used to be a fort. I never thought I'd be put in here. Didn't even dream about it. Yikes. Alright, well that's just... Ah, uh, yikes. Just about everything. Anything? Nope. Let's go through here, then. Random battles, random battles. Hopefully I can't confirm this will be our last one for the day. Alright, Mal. That. You missed! Mal, I am, uh, very disappointed in your performance today. You are not bringing your A-game today. Is something the matter? You want to talk about it? Hey, we poisoned the wall. Too bad we can't see it go off, though. That's a shame. Oh, well. It's a price to pay. Alright, well, Johnny can take care of you. Mal is paralyzed. That's okay. We don't even need Mal. Okay, we did. Damn it. Now it's gonna get another random ring on Mal. The poor girl. She's traumatized. And near death, by the way. Mal is like on death row right now. Don't ever mess with me again. If you do, I'll get angry. Anyway, level up for Shania. Alright, uh... Gonna heal Mal up. Mm. Is there anything else? I did get some new Stellars. Is there anything I can equip? Anything I can equip at all? Nope. No. I didn't really got nothing. Alright. Well, let's continue forward. I can hear something from over there. Over there means outside. Hey, quick, open it. Gotta think of an Al Capone voice. Hold on. It won't open. It appears to be an electric door. Could it be that, that the power is cut? Wow, you've got a good eye. The breakers probably tripped with all the commotion. I wonder if there's a control room somewhere. Perhaps. Perhaps. What's in you, buddy? A mono leaf. Okay. Alright. Well, with that being said, I'm gonna use a tent here. We we're kind of beat up. But we're doing fine. That being said, we made a lot of progress within Alcatraz. It seems we found the exit, but we can't open the door. We're so close, but yet so far. 
next time on Shadow Hearts from the New World. We're going to hunt for the control room and see if we can switch those breakers on and hopefully get the hell out of Alcatraz. See you guys then.